This is how the television used to look like. It was created in San Francisco on September 7, 1927. It was created by Philo Francois. It provided shows that were usually in black and white. The first television with a remote control came in 1950. They are much bigger and thinner. They have 4K OLED high resolution for better viewing. And almost every TV provides smart features and applications for better viewing. This is a vintage phone from the olden days. The first phone was invented by Alexander Graham Bell in 1976. Unlike the modern phones, they were connected to the wall for power. The dial in the middle allowed people to enter numbers. You also had limited time to talk, allowing you for only 30 minutes of talking time. And look, this is a phone from modern times. They look very different from vintage ones. They are touched through screens which is used instead of buttons. They come with a camera, a built-in compass, and other things, and provide applications like games, video watching, and more. Unlike old phones, they are not connected to the wall and are portable. When the battery dies, they can be recharged. This is how the vacuum used to look like. The first vacuum was made in 1860 by Daniel Hess, called Carpet Sweeper. His vacuum cleaner had an internal combustion engine which powered a piston pump that pulled the air through a cloth filter. Another early vacuum was made in 1868 by Yves W. McGaffey. It was called the Whirlwind. It had rotating brush which generated suction. It was kind of difficult to use because the user had to manually turn a crank while pushing it across the floor. In the video, it was a manual mechanism which helped to be more portable and less heavy. These standing vacuums would come with a pump for the vacuum and a bag to hold the dirt. But it didn't work well. And this is what it looks like now. They come with a scanning to track the dirt and dust. It shows that you can also suck up bacteria and viruses. It also comes with a sleek design. They have a high-tech vacuuming system. It allows you to monitor what's happening. It has a software to help get the dust. This help when going over different kinds of surfaces. High suction power. Together with a filtration system. It could also hold more and have a bigger capacity. They also have cleaning robots that do it for you. It vacuums your carpets and hard floors. Automatically adjusts between floor types. <laughs> and even around under furnitures, along wall edges. It holds responsive cleaning technology. Forty robotic behaviors has 60 plus decisions per second. Light touch bumper technology. Wall following technology.
cliff detection sensors. Very, very easy to use. You just have to press clean. This is a vintage cars from olden days. They were first called automobile. Twenty-five Productions version of the automobile happened between 1886 and 1893. They only had three wheels since they were not satisfied with the steering system for the four-wheelers. The first stationary gasoline engine was a one-cylinder, two-stroke unit. And these are our modern cars. Cars now have grown much better in design and technology.
cars are different depending on the type they are. They now have different gear. Thank you. 